In this video today, we're going to show you how to set up a geofence or a virtual boundary to be used with your iTrack GPS tracking device. So to start with, we need to create a zone. So from the home page here, if you select your object on the left hand side from the object panel. And then on the map where you want to start drawing the zone, if you right click and then select new zone. Now we can begin to plot the zone using a series of clicks with your mouse. So you can make the zone whichever shape you like. So in this example, we're just going to do a simple square. And then on the final point, if you double click, that completes the zone. Once you've drawn the zone, you can edit it and change the shape of it to, to the desired shape. Once you're happy with the zone shape and size and position, you can give the zone a name. So in this example, we're going to call it caravan storage. And then click save. So now we have the zone. The next thing we need to do is create an event. So from the settings button here in the top left corner, if we click that, then a new window will open. And then we can click the events tab at the, uh, tab at the top. And then if you click the uh, plus icon in the bottom left corner to add a new event. So we're going to give the event a name. So in this example, we're going to call it Caravan Storage Zone Breach. And then in the type drop down menu, Scroll right down to the bottom and select zone out. So in this example, we're going to create an event for if the object or the caravan or the device moves out of that zone. If you wanted to be alerted if it moved in the zone, then you'd select zone in. But in this example, we're going to select zone out. And then select the object that you want the event to relate to. So we're going to select caravan angel. And then select the zone and it's the zone that we've just created, caravan storage here. And then we need to click the notifications tab and then select system message, push notification, sound alert, and the email box, and enter the email here that you want the alert to be sent to. You can enter more than one email address, you just need to separate them by a comma. So now we'll, if that tracker leaves that zone, we'll be alerted via a system message within the software. You'll get a push notification through the app if you're using an Android device. There'll be a sound alert within the software and then you'll be receiving, be receiving an email with a notification to say that the object has left the zone. And then simply click save, close the window and that's the event and the zone created and complete. So now, if the caravan angel leaves this zone here, you'll be alerted via a system message or an email. I hope you found this video helpful. Have a great day.